Hey, what's up, guys? All right, so it was just announced by the FHFA, which is the Federal Housing Finance Agency, that the new conforming loan amount for 2022 is now increasing to $647,200, okay? What does that mean? For most people, it doesn't mean anything, all right? It just doesn't. Uh, in the Houston area, the average home price uh, as of around October this year was around 377. The median home price is around 305. Okay, so for most people, definitely in Houston, uh, probably in a lot of other areas around Texas, this is not having an effect. All right, it's not having any impact on, on for, for most people that are buying homes or looking to buy a home in 2022. For people that are buying in that higher end, so 500, 600, 700,000, it is having an impact for them and this is why the loan limit the conforming loan limit for 2021 as of right now is 548,250 okay so what that means is if you purchase a home and you have a loan amount over 548,250 it's considered a jumbo loan okay why is that important jumbo loans are more difficult to qualify for they may have higher interest rates more of a down payment that is the difference between jumbo and convention, excuse me, conforming. All right, so a conforming loan as of 2021 is a loan amount under 548,250. Next year, that number is going up to 647,200, $647,200. It's going up. So, again, for most people, this is not having an impact. For people that are buying at higher end, depending on where you're at, uh, and for us in Texas, uh, 647,200 is making an impact on them, all right? Because again, this is loan amount, not sale price. Let's be very clear here. So if you purchase a home over 647, just say you buy a $700,000 home, if you put down enough money to get it under 647,200 next year, okay, right, talking next year, 2022, now you have a conforming loan. Big difference big difference, qualifying, interest rates, all that stuff. So this is a big deal for people that are purchasing in that higher end price point. For most people, this is not having an impact at all, all right? For us in this industry, it's nice because now we have more flexibility for people that are buying higher end homes. It definitely makes a difference for them. But again, for the majority of people, this is not having an impact at all. But it is good news for real estate agents, uh, mortgage professionals. For us, it's definitely good news for us that we have that uh, we have that higher loan amount now, where we can still get someone into a conforming loan instead of taking it jumbo. So, if you got questions about this, please reach out to me. I'd love to answer your questions, and I will talk to you guys soon.